A group of thieves making their way across multiple counties in Tampa Bay, stealing guns and cars in their path. Good evening, I'm Stacy Scheibel. And I'm Keith Kate. Thank you for joining us. Two of those guns, including a rifle, were stolen from the unmarked patrol car of a Hillsborough County Sheriff's deputy. News Channel East Lenny Sue Paul joining us live with the story tonight. Lenny, I know this is an ongoing investigation. We also know authorities are looking to clamp down on this ring of thieves, but the good news is at least some of these guns have been recovered. Yes, Keith, good evening, and that includes those two guns from a Hillsborough County Sheriff's deputy, and tonight we're learning more about how these guns ended up in the hands of a criminal and how Snapchat played a big role in finding them. Tonight, an investigation into the complexity of a multi-county crime spree and nearly half a dozen suspects involved, stealing a series of cars and firearms dating back to at least March. Two of those guns, including an AR-15-style rifle, were stolen from a Hillsborough County Sheriff's deputy. They were located in the trunk of an unmarked car. But it's a very, very serious matter, especially with respect to a stolen weapon potentially being used in the commission of a violent crime. Any person that is a responsible gun owner should take the necessary precautions to absolutely ensure that they're safeguarding their weapons, whether in their home, in their office, and certainly in their car. Is this a problem we're seeing more often? Off-duty deputies just as likely to be the victim of a burglary as anybody else. It always comes back to complacency. According to the search warrant, the guns were stolen at the end of July. Then, one week later, detectives were able to find them after a picture of the rifle was posted on Snapchat. Randy Sutton is a former police lieutenant weighing in. There will be an investigation into how that weapon fell into the hands of, of, a, of a bad guy. Is this common to see? It's very common that, that, um, that there are weapons in vehicles. And here's a copy of the search warrant. Again, this is a multi-county crime spree, including Pinellas, Manatee, and Sarasota counties. And of course, we'll continue to follow up on this as the investigation continues. In the newsroom, Lenny Sue Paul, 8 on your side.